At Velocity Tech Solutions, we sell new and refurbished computer equipment, thoroughly tested and assembled to our customers' needs. The PowerEdge R740 is a Dell rack server in the 14th generation lineup. It's becoming more common on the secondary market and is a highly capable machine that is still supported by Dell. When we receive an order from a customer, our operations team immediately begins to gather the necessary components for the build and then brings it to our tech room for assembly. Even at this stage, we check all the parts for compatibility issues and damage, trying to catch any potential problems. Once everything is verified, we assemble the machine. The machine is powered on into the pre-boot environment, where we spend most of our time. The R740, along with all the source servers in the 14th generation PowerEdge series, comes pre-installed with several features, including an automatic firmware upgrade tool and a diagnostics tool. We then test the machine using the built-in Dell Diagnostics tool, also found in the lifecycle controller. We run the diagnostics tool for 4 to 8 hours to ensure that no component fails. The firmware update tool found in the lifecycle controller will detect the various components installed into the server, including the BIOS and the iDRAC, and attempt to pull any needed updates from Dell's website. The R740 requires some form of storage controller, which is usually a RAID controller. We ensure that the RAID controller is capable of creating a RAID configuration with the hard drives installed in the machine, and then reset the controller to factory defaults. If requested by the customer, we will configure the RAID array on their behalf. After all of the updates have been performed, the diagnostics have run, and no issues were found with the machine, we reset all of the components to factory defaults so the customer has a new device experience and need not worry about pre-existing configurations.
We will also install an operating system into the machine if requested. Most commonly, we will install a version of Windows. When we do so, we also run automatic updates before setting Windows to the out-of-box experience.